shower curtain rings. Do you know that you can use them for so many more things than just like hang a shower curtain? Well, in today's video, I'm going to show you the best DIYs and hacks. guys so excited for today's video because I'm going to be sharing a few hacks that I have that I create for you guys I'm going to be using these two type of shower curtain rings that you can get at Dollar Tree or any other store or maybe Walmart something like that they're so cheap but you can create so many cool stuff to decorate your home with them I hope that you like and that you enjoyed today's video if you do please that big thumbs up it really helps to support my channel let me know in the comments which of these ideas is one of your favorites and make sure that you are subscribed to my channel and and yeah, I hope that you are ready because I am really excited. Let's do it together. Okay, let's get started with this project. I'm going to be using these shower curtain rings that I got and they come in so many different colors that you can choose from or you don't have to mind about that because you can always paint them like I'm going to be doing in this project. I'm going to be using one package and I'm also going to be using this very small piece of PVC tube. You can use something similar or maybe something that you have at home that can work and that feed a can. What I'm going to be doing is I'm going to put the small piece of PVC tube on the center and then I'm going to start gluing all of the shower curtain rings around my PVC tube. I'm going to be using hot glue because it dries super fast but if you want this project to be a little bit more stronger you can use a stronger glue maybe like a 6000 or super glue. I basically use all of my shower curtain rings for this project. You can use more, you can use less depending on how you want your project to look like and guys I use these type of shower curtain rings for this project but you can do the same project using a similar shower curtain ring that you maybe have or that you can get at Dollar Tree okay once I stick everything together it's time to paint them look like one piece so I'm going to be using some spray paint and I'm going to paint everything in black color I'm going to let it dry and this is how it turns out and I think it looks beautiful now it's time to add a candle on top you can use like a taper candle from Dollar Tree something like that you can use a battery operated candle it's up to you but this is how my project turned out it was so easy I did it like in less than five minutes it looks beautiful you can make a set of these you can put these anywhere in your house and it's going to work as a perfect all year round home decor piece Okay guys, for this next project, I'm going to be using these shower curtain rings that you can get at Dollar Tree or any other store. They're super cheap. And what I'm going to do is I'm also going to be using some twine and I'm basically going to cover the whole shower curtain ring with the twine and for that I'm going to be using hot glue because it dries super fast it's going to make these products so much easier I'm going to do it like by sections and I'm gonna be able to do these so much faster At the end you want to make sure that you cover the whole piece so I keep adding hot glue and rolling until I cover the whole shower curtain ring. Okay guys, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to use some nautical rope from Dollar Tree. And I'm sorry about this next part of this project because I don't know why my camera didn't focus anything but but hopefully you can still see what I'm doing basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the nautical rope between the shower curtain ring and then I'm going to make like a small loop and I'm going to stick that with hot glue now you can leave it like that but just to make it look so much better you can add twine and I'm basically going to wrap off that part with the twine once I have that part ready I'm going to cut the other side of the nautical rope you can leave your nautical rope as long as you want I think mine is like 12 inches long and now what I'm going to do is I'm going to start working on the other side of my nautical rope I'm going to leave a small space about like three 
inches maybe and then I'm going to use my twine again and I'm going to add a little bit of hot glue and I'm going to start wrapping a small piece a small part of my nautical rope hope you can see what I'm doing once I have that part ready I'm going to work on the side of the nautical rope and I need to basically spread all of my nautical rope it's going to look like so many small pieces of twine but this is going to add the perfect touch to this project so I highly recommend doing this and you can do this same project using nautical rope or maybe any other rope that you have at home okay once I have that part ready basically my project is done I made a curtain tie back and this is how you can put it on your curtain and this is going to look beautiful on any room especially if you're looking for like a boho style or maybe like some nautical vibes in your room or your house this is going to add the perfect touch to your curtains it's super easy to do you can do as many as you need and for sure I have to say that this is one of my favorite projects because it turns out amazing with a high-end look Okay, it's time for the next project. I'm going to be using this circular plaque that you can get maybe from Dollar Tree or maybe from Walmart for only $1. And what I'm going to do is I'm also going to be using, of course, some shower curtain rings. This time I got this ones in black color and I'm going to leave them black because I love the color and I forgot to say that I already like stain my piece of wood with some Waverly wax in antique color just for reference you can paint your circular plaque any color what I'm going to do is I'm going to start sticking all of these shower curtain rings around my circular plaque around my piece of wood and I'm going to be using just hot glue because like I always said it dries faster so much easier for your projects but if you want to make it stronger, just use a stronger glue. What I'm trying to do here is I want to make like a tray using the shower curtain rings. And this is going to add the perfect touch to the sides of my tray. And you can add handles to your tray if you want. But I'm actually decide to leave it just like that because I think it's more than enough and it looks beautiful already. Once I stick all of the shower curtain rings on my piece of wood, this is how my tray looks now and I love it if you want to add something extra you can use some nautical rope or any rope that you maybe have at home I have this one from Dollar Tree is black and it's going to match perfect for this project so I'm going to add a little bit of hot glue on all of the edges of my piece of wood and I'm going to stick that rope around my tray Once I was done, this is how my project turned out. And you can decorate your tray in so many ways. You can add some plants or candle holders like I did. You can use it in your kitchen. You can use it in your bathroom. Or basically, you can use it to decorate any part of your home. And I think it looks beautiful and I love the colors that I use. Okay guys, I'm going to show you one of the easiest ways that I think you can do using these shower curtain rings. I got this one and I really like that neutral color that it has. So I'm going to leave it like that, but you can paint it if you want. And I'm also going to be using these very small pieces of wood um, that I got from Dollar Tree. They come in different shapes, designs and things that you can use to create this project. I got this ones that have flowers and leaves and I'm going to do a set of four so I'm going to get a four shower curtain rings and four of these leaves and flowers and basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to stick that flower or that leaf on top of my shower curtain ring and that's it I'm going to be repeating the same steps until I have four and what I was trying to do is some napkin holders and this is going to work 
perfect and they're going to look super cute the vibe or the style is going to depend like on what type of wooden piece you find at Dollar Tree I think the ones that I got match perfect now for the spring season and also for summer I have like these very nautical napkins at home this is how I style them and I love this project so much it was so easy but it has this high-end look that I love and anyone can do it so fun too so I hope that you like it Okay, I have this idea on mine for a very long time and it was using these type of shower curtain rings, like the very round ones. So I'm basically going to be using like one package and a half for this project. What I'm going to do is first I'm going to start like clipping um, those shower curtain rings. As you can see, they have like a small clip. So I have to make sure that all of them are clipped. I feel like that's the first step that you have to do. And then I'm basically going to start just gluing all of them together, making a small like tower basically and i'm going to do a set of two the first one is going to have around six shower curtain rings stick together and then i'm going to make another set which is going to have around 10 of these shower curtain rings i'm doing the same thing i'm just adding glue and i'm sticking them together and you have to make sure that when you are sticking these um they look as straight as possible and without any glue mess Once I have these two pieces together, it's time to add some paint and I'm going to be using some spray paint in this beautiful color. I'm going to spray this outside and then I'm going to let it dry. Once they're dry, this is how they look and you can do so many things with these. They maybe can be like candle holders, but this time I'm going to be making two small aesthetic vases that you can put anywhere in your house. In the taller one, I'm going to be adding these flowers in this beautiful color and in the smaller one, one, I'm going to add like a small bush of greenery. This is how I style these two mini vases and I love how they look. I love the shape that it has. It's very original and different and it's also super easy to do and on a budget because I use like one package and a half of these shower curtain rings. Okay guys, so for this project, I'm going to be using these shower curtain rings that I get from Dollar Tree. You can get these and the package bring 12. So I'm going to be using these. I'm not going to use them all. I think like five or six curtain rings, but you decide how many you want to use. Um, anyways, I'm going to be using this youth cord that I also get from Dollar Tree. And basically what I'm going to be doing is to cover the shower curtain rings with the youth cord. I'm going to be covering these super easy but it's going to take you a little bit of time so just relax put some music and enjoy the process Once I covered the first one with the youth cord, I'm going to be adding the next one and I'm going to place it inside of the one that has the rope. And then I'm going to start covering that. That way I'm going to make sure that this is going to look like a chain garland. I'm going to be doing the same with all of the curtain rings. Like I said, I think I used like six, but you can do it longer if you want or um, a little bit shorter. And once I cover all of them with the youth cord, this is how um, my rope garland chain is going to look. Um, if you want, you can add, you can put some fire in it and that way the rope is going to burn out just a little bit. And it's going to give it more color and it's going to give it a nicer touch. So yeah, this is how I did it this is how my project ended up looking it's super inexpensive I only spent two dollars on this project and I think it looks 
amazing you can place this anywhere inside of a tray on a table um, and i think it looks super nice okay my love this is how all of my projects turn out i hope that you like them and i really hope that you can get some ideas and inspiration from this video of how you can use these shower curtain rings to create so many things i know you can do so many more but let me know in the comments if you have any other idea we maybe can do like a part two of this if you want to guys thank you so much for the love and support if you like the video please a big thumbs up make sure that you follow me on my social media pages all of the links are in the description box of this video and every single one thank you so much for the love and support guys and see you in the next one Mwah. bye